Betelgeuse or Betelgeuse is a red giant star. If you put it where the sun is, it would extend out to the orbit of Jupiter. It's enormous and very unstable. It's about to explode. These are among the biggest explosions of radio energy in the entire universe, generating more energy than a billion suns. As we contemplate the sun, we are aware of its enormous power and the energy it emanates throughout our solar system. This radiant star, a blazing ball of nuclear fusion, sustains life on Earth and dictates the rhythm of our days and seasons. It is hard to imagine anything capable of surpassing our sun. Yet beyond our own star lies a cosmic wonder that makes even the mightiest solar giants seem insignificant in comparison. Betelgeuse. Betelgeuse, the red supergiant, defies explanation with its enormous diameter, irregular pulsations, and unpredictable behavior. This enigmatic star has fascinated astronomers for centuries, presenting mysteries that challenge our understanding of stellar evolution. The star is an enigma to scientists who are still studying its power and potential. As they investigate this magnificent star in depth, they have discovered something terrifying. Join us on this journey as we delve into the constellation Orion with the James Webb Telescope and explore how its arrival could change our understanding of the universe and its impact on the cosmos. This exploration promises to unveil new insights into the life cycle of stars and the dynamic processes governing their transformations. If you're interested in keeping up to date with news from the universe and its surroundings, subscribe to our channel. Be sure to like this video and turn on the notification bell. Stay connected with us for more fascinating discoveries and cosmic adventures. Although many people are unaware of this fact, it is possible to spot Betelgeuse in the night sky during the winter months in the Northern Hemisphere. This bright, ruddy star stands out even to the naked eye, a beacon in the cold winter sky. Just look up at the constellation Orion and Canis Major to see this dazzling star in all its splendor. Orion, often referred to as the Hunter, is one of the most recognizable constellations, making Betelgeuse relatively easy to locate. There you can easily find the reddish-orange star that marks the upper left corner of the rectangular shape of the constellation. This distinctive color and position make it an intriguing object for stargazers and amateur astronomers alike. The star is one of the largest and brightest in the night sky, making it difficult to miss. However, if you have looked closely at this star, you will have noticed that it does not remain constant. In fact, it varies in brightness periodically. This variability is a characteristic feature of red supergiants, reflecting complex internal processes. This peculiarity is no coincidence since Betelgeuse, as the star is called, is no ordinary star. Its massive size and advanced stage of evolution set it apart from the myriad of stars in the night sky. Although to us, it may appear just to be one more in the vast firmament, it is located at a distance of more than 640 light years from us. This distance, while immense, places Betelgeuse relatively close in astronomical terms, making its study particularly significant. At first glance, this figure may not seem impressive, but in reality, it represents an enormous distance. To illustrate this magnitude, let's imagine that we could travel at the speed of light. Even in that hypothetical scenario, it would take us more than 640 years to reach Betelgeuse. Such a journey would span generations, highlighting the vast scales involved in space exploration. If we wanted to undertake such a journey in a spacecraft, even using our most advanced technologies, it would take us more than 12 million years to reach it. This figure far exceeds the entire history of human civilization on Earth. Such an expedition would stretch far beyond our current technological capabilities and lifespans. However, the scarcity of light from Betelgeuse is not only due to the distance that separates us from it. The star's inherent properties also play a crucial role in its visibility from Earth. Betelgeuse is what is known as a pulsating red supergiant which means that it is an ancient, massive star that undergoes expansions and contractions. These pulsations are driven by the complex interplay of nuclear fusion and gravitational forces within the star. During these cycles, its brightness can vary in the night sky, becoming more intense or dimmer. These brightness changes can occur over extended periods, ranging from 10 to hundreds of days. This dynamic behavior makes Betelgeuse an object of continuous interest and observation. 
The amazing thing is that Betelgeuse can oscillate in brightness over a wide range. It can range from near magnitude 0.5 to reach zero magnitude, making it extremely bright. These changes follow cycles, with the shortest being 185 days and the longest being 2,335 days. Such variations provide valuable data for understanding the underlying mechanisms driving these fluctuations. At certain times, Betelgeuse can become quite faint, which is called its minimum magnitude. In February 2021, it was reported to present its lowest minimum magnitude in a long time, reaching a magnitude of plus 1.614. Although relatively bright, it is definitely fainter than how we usually observe Betelgeuse. This dimming event sparked widespread interest and numerous studies to unravel its cause. However, brightness is not the only outstanding feature of the star. Betelgeuse is known for its distinctive reddish color, which is due to its cool surface with a temperature of about 3,500 Kelvin. This cooler temperature is a hallmark of red supergiants, contrasting sharply with hotter blue stars. This temperature is much lower than the surface of our sun, which reaches 5,500 Kelvin. This lower temperature means that Betelgeuse emits much less energy per unit area compared to the sun. That is why, despite being one of the largest stars we know, it appears much dimmer. The vast size of Betelgeuse, combined with its lower temperature, gives it its characteristic reddish hue. Betelgeuse is like that giant that is satisfied with a low profile and doesn't need to show off its size to feel important. Its serene glow in the night sky belies the immense energies at play within. However, don't be fooled by its appearance. Betelgeuse is a supergiant star that is about 20 times the mass of our sun. This is one of the reasons why this star has been the subject of numerous studies over the centuries. Its colossal mass and evolutionary stage make it a key object for understanding stellar physics. It has been a prominent object in the night sky and was first identified by the ancient Greek astronomer Hipparchus. Its name in Arabic means the Orion's armpit, reflecting its position in the constellation. Although not much could be known about Betelgeuse at the time, modern telescopes have enabled researchers to study this phenomenon in greater detail. Advances in observational technology have opened new windows into the star's complex structure and behavior. By analyzing the light emitted by Betelgeuse, astronomers have been able to determine many of its properties, such as its size, temperature, and composition. The Hubble Space Telescope, for example, has provided detailed images of Betelgeuse's surface, revealing intricate patterns of gases and dust. These observations have allowed researchers to create models to understand the star's behavior and predict its future evolution. Betelgeuse has also been studied using the Atacama Large Millimeter Slash Submillimeter Array, ALMA, a state-of-the-art observatory located in Chile. ALMA has provided high-resolution images of the surface of Betelgeuse, revealing details about its structure and behavior. These cutting-edge instruments continue to enhance our knowledge of the stellar giant. One of the most remarkable discoveries made by ALMA is the presence of an extensive plume of gas extending from the surface of the star. This plume is believed to be caused by pulsations from Betelgeuse. These pulsations can be explained by a process called convection, involving the rising of hot gas and the sinking of cold gas. This motion creates waves that travel through the star's atmosphere, causing it to expand and contract. This dynamic process contributes to the star's variability and complex behavior. Thanks to the Hubble Space Telescope, detailed images of Betelgeuse's surface have also been obtained, revealing intricate patterns of gas and dust. These observations have allowed researchers to create models to understand the star's behavior and predict how it might behave in the future. Such detailed studies help refine our models of stellar evolution and supergiant dynamics. In addition, Betelgeuse's surface is marked by dark spots, also known as star spots or magnetic spots. These areas on the star's surface exhibit particularly strong magnetic intensity. These regions, known as star spots, are cooler areas on the surface of Betelgeuse. This is because the star's magnetic field inhibits the flow of gas from the interior to the surface, creating a cooling effect. These spots can provide insights into the magnetic activity of massive stars. As a result, the spots appear darker compared to the rest of the surface. Betelgeuse's magnetic field is believed to be thousands of times stronger than that of the sun. 
This intense magnetic field causes the gas on the surface of the star to be trapped in loops or arcs, describing regions of intense magnetic activity that are visible as star spots. These magnetic loops can extend far into the star's outer atmosphere. It is important to mention that the presence of star spots is not unique to Betelgeuse, as they are also observed in other stars, including our own Sunday. The star spots in Betelgeuse are especially interesting because of their size. They are several times larger than Earth and cover up to 20% of the star's surface, which is an incredible size. The presence of these spots suggests that Betelgeuse may have an active magnetic field, which plays a crucial role in shaping its outer atmosphere and influencing its stellar winds. These stellar winds are streams of charged particles that flow outward from the star into space, carrying with them elements synthesized in the star's core. These elements are essential for the formation of new stars and planetary systems. Therefore, understanding Betelgeuse's stellar wind is essential for understanding the broader processes of stellar evolution and the creation of chemical elements. This process is fundamental to the evolution of stars and the formation of planets and stars. The winds from Betelgeuse can have a significant impact on its environment. The winds can carry away a substantial amount of material from the star's outer layers, enriching the interstellar medium with elements synthesized in the star's core. These elements can then be incorporated into new stars and planetary systems, contributing to the diversity of cosmic matter. The star's winds can also interact with its surroundings, creating intricate structures in space. These structures can include shock waves and regions of ionized gas, known as H2 regions, which glow brightly in visible light. These regions are indicators of active star formation and are often found in regions of the galaxy where new stars are being born. Betelgeuse's winds and stellar activity can have a profound impact on its surroundings. The star's winds can shape the environment around it, creating bubbles and cavities in the interstellar medium. These structures can affect the formation of new stars and planetary systems, influencing the evolution of galaxies over cosmic timescales. In conclusion, Betelgeuse is not only a fascinating object of study for astronomers, but also a key player in the cosmic drama of stellar evolution. Its massive size, advanced stage of evolution, and complex behavior make it a crucial object for understanding the life cycles of stars and the processes that shape our universe. Located in the constellation Orion, Betelgeuse continues to captivate astronomers with its colossal size and dynamic behavior. This red supergiant star is approximately 20 times more massive than our sun and shines with a distinctive reddish-orange hue due to its relatively cool surface temperature of about 3,500 Kelvin. Despite its lower temperature compared to hotter, blue stars, Betelgeuse still radiates immense energy, though its luminosity varies significantly over time. One of the most intriguing aspects of Betelgeuse is its variability in brightness. Like many red supergiants, Betelgeuse undergoes periodic pulsations caused by complex internal processes. These pulsations can cause its brightness to fluctuate over periods ranging from several months to several years. Astronomers have observed Betelgeuse dimming and brightening irregularly, with notable recent dimming events sparking intense interest and speculation. The variability of Betelgeuse isn't just a matter of brightness. It also hints at profound changes happening within the star. These changes are driven by the star's advanced stage of evolution. Betelgeuse has exhausted its core hydrogen fuel, leading to the fusion of heavier elements like helium and carbon in its core. This nuclear fusion process generates the energy that powers the star and sustains its immense size. Despite being over 640 light years away from Earth, Betelgeuse's impact on our understanding of stellar evolution is profound. Studying Betelgeuse provides insights into the fate of massive stars, including how they evolve and ultimately end their lives. While Betelgeuse is currently in its red supergiant phase, astronomers anticipate its eventual demise in a spectacular supernova explosion. The prospect of Betelgeuse going supernova is both thrilling and daunting for astronomers. A supernova event from Betelgeuse would be visible to the naked eye on Earth, potentially shining as brightly as the full moon for weeks or even months. Such an event would provide an unprecedented opportunity to study the dynamics of supernovae up close and gain insights into the formation of elements essential for life. In addition to its variability and impending supernova, Betelgeuse also exhibits intriguing phenomena on its surface. 
Observations from telescopes like the Hubble Space Telescope and the Atacama Large Millimeter Slash Submillimeter Array, ALMA, have revealed complex structures and features on Betelgeuse's surface. These include giant convective cells, massive star spots, and even a mysterious plume of gas extending from its atmosphere. The presence of these features highlights Betelgeuse's active and dynamic nature. The star's convective cells are immense, with each cell dwarfing the size of Earth. These cells contribute to the star's pulsations and variability by transporting heat and energy from the core to the surface in turbulent motions. Meanwhile, the star spots on Betelgeuse's surface are akin to sunspots but on a much larger scale. These cooler regions are believed to be areas where the star's intense magnetic field inhibits the flow of hot gases from the interior to the surface, resulting in localized cooling. The discovery of these star spots challenges astronomers to refine their models of how magnetic fields influence the behavior of massive stars. Furthermore, Betelgeuse's extended atmosphere, as observed by ALMA, reveals a plume of gas extending from the star. This plume likely results from the star's pulsations and convective motions, which inject material into its outer layers and beyond. Studying this gas plume provides clues about the mechanisms that drive Betelgeuse's variability and the eventual fate of its expelled material in interstellar space.